Okay, today we're in the ecclesiastical parish of Scothurn, which apparently in Old English means Thornbush of the Scots. It's a little village of under 800 people and one as yet unconquered food challenge. Which is why I'm here. Who's gonna... Everyone loves a pub quiz, everyone. I feel like I'm in an episode of Cold Feet with this music. We had like Dido, Coldplay. Bit depressing for you. Bit, bit of Buble in the middle though, I didn't mind that. Buble was alright. Oh yeah. You're in for a show now. Alright, so this week I'm at a place called The Bottle and Glass in, how do you pronounce the name of the town? Scotland. Oh, I said Scotland. And I'm taking on their, uh, does this have a special name? Or just the burger challenge? Or I should call it the chips, the lots of chips with a burger on the side challenge. Beastie bottle. Bacon burger beef burger. <laughs> <laughs> what kind of stupid name is that? Beastie bottle bacon beef burger challenge. That's a good one. I do like a bit of alliteration. You get uh, 15 minutes, right? That's it. Only 15 minutes to finish, and this is a lot of chips. And uh, I take it nobody's done it yet. Nope. Oh, the amount of chips, man. Let's get started. Is it? Are you gonna time me? Go. Ah, what's up, everybody? Welcome back to another episode. And um, today, I'm taking on this ridiculously named Beastie Bottle Bacon Beef Burger Challenge. Um, although it should probably be called the uh, Big Pile of Chips Challenge, with a uh, with a burger on the side, you know, for, for good measure, a little bit of flavour. <laughs> uh, I, I should say that the burger was um, was pretty big too. Ooh, the burgers are dense. Yeah. Dense too. The 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 cow that this burger was made from, assuming it was all from one cow, <laughs> was definitely a, a, an athletic cow. Definitely into something like CrossFit or some kind of resistance training. Some glute ham raises, some hip thrusts because it was um, it was thick, tasty, but um, hard to eat, which explains why I'm squishing it up. As you can see, this one uh, it caught me by surprise. I thought it would be a piece of cake or a piece of cow. But not so. <sighs> Enjoying the show? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, those poor ladies. They're just trying to mind their own business, enjoy a little bit of pub lunch on their lunch break. <laughs> and uh, this is what they see. They might be enjoying the show up until now, but uh, as you can probably tell, it's about to get a whole lot messier because. I think it's around now, I start to panic. I'm thinking, oh man, these fries are gonna take, they're gonna take a lot of chewing. They're gonna take a while to get down. So I have to try and speed up a little. <laughs> <coughs> yeah, speed up and not choke to death. <laughs> I started too lazy, you know, which is why I'm now bowling up the fries and eating them really inefficiently. They're dropping out my mouth and everything. Can I get a Diet Coke or something? Hey, Diet Coke to the rescue. I do actually have some sauce. I got some barbecue sauce in advance, but for some reason totally forgot that I, uh, that I actually had it. If I look a little thicker than usual this week, it's because there are like three cameras on me. They say the camera adds 10 pounds, right? So. Oh, I must have used that gag in excess of like 12, 15 times, at least on this channel. Um, I should say, by the way, if I, if I sound a little weird, a little bit nasal, um, I got the sniffles. I don't know what's wrong with me. It's not the it's not the sea wood, but I actually had kind of a this, this is where the excuse comes in. I had a little bit of a sore throat when I was doing this challenge <laughs> Which I'm gonna very conveniently use as an excuse for being so terrible <laughs> But yeah, that's why I sound a, a little weird. We're on the uh, look at that. That's honesty scraping up a few uh, a few chips from the table there and uh, yeah, we're, we're down to the end now, but it's getting a little close a little, uh, a little too close to my liking, actually. But uh, anyway, let, let's mention the rules of the challenge. I should have done this at the start. <laughs> this is a mess. But uh, yeah, you get 15 minutes to finish this burger, along with, I think it's like three and a half pounds of fries and uh, some onion rings too. It costs 20 quid, but if you do finish it in 15 minutes, you get the meal free and you get a spot on the wall of fame. Don't totally forget how the barbecue sauce.
Hey, there is the phantom barbecue sauce. That I, I'm normally not that prepared, so the fact that I ordered it in advance is unusual, but the fact that I didn't use it is, uh, that's, that's very usual. <laughs> I'm in the last minute yet. Look how panic-stricken my face is. I didn't really know where I was because the, uh, the owner wasn't giving me a, a countdown or anything. So I'm thinking, oh, I better rush these, uh, these onion rings. I, I don't have long left. But, uh, yeah, we got there in the end. Hope you enjoyed it, and um, I'll catch you in the next video. <coughs> this music, man. <laughs> the I am. Everybody hurts. I'm going to it all. <laughs> all right. That was harder than I thought it was going to be, man. <laughs> I started off pretty slow. I'm thinking, oh, this should be a piece of cake. Then I realised how many chips there are. I'm thinking, oh, God, I need to speed up now. <laughs> 55 seconds to go. Oh. Yeah, you don't have a dessert menu, do you? <laughs> You're taking the piss. <laughs> that one caught me by surprise. I started too slow. And no dessert menu! What the heck is that? <laughs>